Hey guys, back with another video. It's I feel like everything is getting interesting by today. This one's about the YMW Melly trial. I just wanted to read. I read a little bit before this video started, and I feel like it's interesting because they're saying that there's no evidence. So they're saying his friend Denise Williams and some other guys they have no evidence of anything about killing, and they feel like it's like a setup. So it's almost like they kind of put him in that situation to say that he start uh, to kill like his friends and. Clearly, they have no photos, no evidence, and I feel like it's getting interesting by the day. I was reading on Fox News, shout out to Fox News, in South Florida. It says South Florida News, Fox News. Um, they were talking about how, like, they have no evidence, nothing about why and Debbie Melly doing anything. And, they, and they're saying they think it's like a false fake death because they said in a drive-by shooting they don't have any information about his friend Denise Williams and the other guy. I forgot his name because I'm freestyling on this video, but I did read, so it's not like I didn't read anything, but... Uh, they're pretty much like they, the judge is uh, denying that he has any footage from his friends. It's kind of confusing because I feel like they kind of put him in that spot to kind of set him up. And uh, what do you guys think, guys? Because uh, I feel like all this weird stuff is like sounding kind of fishy. But why Debbie Melly's case is super like super long. You know what I mean? Like they, the judge is already kind of feeling a certain way about it. The jury, yeah, the jury, not the judge, but the jury said that he denies the uh that he did anything pretty much and that their friends it sounds like their friends are like pretty much trying to set him up but i feel like by the day we're gonna find out that he didn't do anything it was all you know it was all like a stage type of thing because even they even said in the article that it was staged there was some like more stuff to it can't really read all that because it's gonna keep me up all night but my thing is that what do you guys think about this whole one debbie melly mur uh this murder trial do you think that they're trying to just set him up to just put him in jail for life, or you think that it was, uh, you think that he did, uh, killed his, uh, what's called so called friends? Um, what do you think about this, uh, situation, guys? Because the Juan W. Melly murder trial is getting interesting, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like they're gonna free him eventually. And it's a you know, fun fact they said that his, um, Spotify listeners went up by 12 million. So <laughs> it just shows you, like, even if a person's in court or they're not in, like, currently active in the, what's called in the industry all like that they're currently active just through like the news it just shows you how many like how much the fans still like them you know what i mean like say if you didn't kill anybody you'll be like, oh cool you know they just move on they just talk about them for a little bit then they move on to the next rapper but right now it's getting interesting they just said he gained 12 million spotify listeners so even after this murder trial he's gaining a lot of attention but yeah let me know what you guys think man the ynw melly murder trial is a little fishy you know what I mean? Like, they've been talking about it for a while, so, but now they're trying to bring it back around again. And I feel like by the day, we're going to find out more and more and more from this uh, situation that he didn't do anything. I feel like he might be innocent, you know what I mean? Because they're saying from the evidence, he got, there's no evidence that he did anything wrong and that his friends uh, staged all this stuff. So, I don't know, man. This is, I mean, this is like all from where I read, you know what I mean? The uh, the judge, the jury that thinks that... Um, it's like a hoax almost because he said that there's no evidence. So I don't know, man. I feel like he might be free. But if he does know any information, you already know a lot of rappers do. They end up snitching. I mean, 6 9 was like the example. Other rappers snitch as well. You know, it's almost like, you know, a small click. So they, if they want to get out of jail, they're going to snitch. And I feel like Juan W. Melly is going to snitch or something's going to happen because see, Gunna got out of jail because he snitched. So, you know what I mean? If Young Thug has information that he snitches, he gets out of jail. That's just how the police operate with these rappers and so and more and other people too. It's not even just rappers. It's just people that know stuff. So I don't know, guys. Let me know in the comments below if I said enough uh, to kind of get you guys, you know, focus on what's really going on. You know, I'm super bad at the whole bunch of memory, but from what I read before this video on Fox News, uh, South Florida Fox News, they pretty much saying that they got no evidence for my friend Denise Williams and, all the, and his other pal. I forgot the other name. But they have, they're saying that there's no evidence from what from the situation, should I say, of the murder trial. So, because they're saying that all that song that he made murder, the how he murdered his uh, friends and stuff, they, they all could have been for clout. So, you know, they're saying, that, oh, yeah, if he was uh, murdered, he wouldn't be here. But they're, they're saying that he, they're still alive. So, I don't know. It just sounds weird to me. It's almost like the whole Tupac thing. They wanted to make a big deal about Tupac. They're like, oh, he's still alive. But we know that proof that he's passed away so you know people still believe that he's still alive so i feel like with this whole situation it just sounds kind of fishy to me you know what i mean he turned himself in 2019 and all that stuff and, and then now we're just like still now they're still talking about it so i don't know well, if I, well let me know in the comments below you know if i did a good job of kind of summing it up for you guys 
But, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like there's only so much you can say about this trial. Because it's just, they're going to keep pushing it, pushing the narrative. Oh, he did this, he did that. You know, by the end of the day, their friends could have easily set him up. You know what I mean? Because people do that. Like, you could be cool with almost everybody. And they could end up saying, oh, Victor did this. Like, for example, they could be like, oh, I did this, I did that. You know, and that's kind of what it seems like they're trying to do in a way. Like, you just get him locked up and never remember him again. You know, it's almost like fake Tattletown. Like, oh, it's not really real, but we're going to snitch on you just to get you locked up. So I don't know, man. I feel like, you know, Ron W. Melly will, I think, eventually get out. I don't think he's going to be in jail for life. If he has enough backup and he uh, ends up snitching or something like that, I feel like he'll get out. Because that's the only way out really out of jail nowadays. You got to, like, snitch or do something. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below about the Ron W. Melly murder trial. I'm very curious what your guys' thoughts are. I know there's probably going to be people out there, like, saying, oh, yeah, he did and all that. But just let me know what you guys think, man. I feel like we can only talk about so much about stuff like this because stuff like this happens every single day and real murders really happen so he could have been a clout thing when he made that song murder on my mind so i don't know it's just hard to say you know what i mean i feel like a lot of, when people make music about specific things a lot of it is marketing because people talk about shooting people all the time and who knows if they really shot anybody they could have just been around when someone got shot so it's all marketing because people forget it's hip-hop it's a uh, it's a game so they they follow the script you know what I mean? If they talk about uh, doing this, doing that, you know what I mean? Like, and then they didn't really do it. It's because they're trying to make money off of it. But they love making money off of violence, sex, drugs, money, because it's making money. But my thing is that I don't do that. You know what I mean? I do positive music. I'm not in the industry. I'm just there as an entertainer, positive artist, just preaching the truth. So just let me know what you guys think, guys. I know I said enough. I feel like if you guys research the Wine Debbie Melly murder trial, you guys are going to be like, hmm, interesting. So it's almost like a movie at this point. We're just learning more and more information. Wine Debbie Melly murder trial video. Let me know what you guys think below. And that's it. You know what I mean? Make sure to go subscribe and stay tuned.